Hi and welcome to this tutorial for LiDAR 360. Today we'll be focusing on a basic function within the software, that being adding, browsing, and exporting data. So first you want to launch the LiDAR 360 software and then you can go into File, Data, and Add Data and then browse for your sample data, select it, and then you can open it. Uh, the software also supports adding data dragging selected files into the UI display and a lie data file will be created in the same directory for each non lie data file imported. Now LiDAR 360 supports the following display modes, uh, that being by height, by intensity, by classification, by RGB, by return, by time, by blend, by tree ID, and by mix. Use the corresponding buttons to switch between display modes. Uh, you can also enhance the rendering effect by using visualization tools such as EDL, uh, PCV, and Glass, which are intuitive and helpful for your quality checks. After the PCV process, the intensity range of the point cloud will be from 0 to 255. Now by clicking on the display by blend or clicking display by intensity, users can see the boundary between different land covers a little bit more clearly. So you want to right click on the data layer and then go to point size to change the point size in display. Another conversion tool is users can set the source unit of the point cloud and then it will be converted into meters. Uh, another one is convert to LAS, so you can convert point clouds in light data format back to LAS, uh, the standard LiDAR point cloud data format. And users can also set the target unit of the point cloud also. And you can also convert your LIDATA point cloud uh, file to an ASCII format, which is a text format that can easily be viewed in a text editor. The other conversion tools is convert to TIFF tool, uh, where you can convert your light data point cloud to raster images according to the attribute of the points in the cell value method. Another one is the convert to shape tool, which can convert a point cloud in light data format to a point cloud in a vector format. The convert to DXF tool can convert a light data file to a point cloud vector data uh, in DXF format. Uh, convert TIFF to Lie Model tool can convert a single band raster data format to a Lie Model format. 
The Lie Model format is a LIDAR360 software proprietary format that allows the converted single band raster data to be displayed and edited in a 3D window. In addition, it also includes convert to texture Lie Model, convert Lie Model to TIFF, convert TIFF to ASCII, and convert TIFF to Lie Data. So please check out our YouTube page for more tutorials and training materials for LIDAR360 and our other software offerings. Thank you.